Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some good old Pokemon Nuzlocke. Uh, today, continuing on fighting the Elite Four, we'll be fighting this lady right here. I also remembered to get rid of the background bloopers, <laughs> which were prevalent in the other two videos. Uh, so, not that I don't mind Wooper, I just feel like it's not the time for him. Plus, a lot of them get hit in the back of Karen. Hello, Wookie. You love dark types? Sure. I bet you do. A woman named Karen can't love a dark type. Who knew? Can love a dark type, I should say. Mm. Alright, let's go. Serious time. Umbreon, huh? Battle throw. Shit. Damn. Why'd you have to know Confuse Ray? God, I hate you so much. Alright, come on. Gotta be serious here. Mmm, you have like the most annoying moves ever, huh? Thank god that Battle Throw never misses. <laughs> gonna be very unfortunate for the next uh, Pokemon, though. Wow, I forgot that you're like a super defense uh, tank there, Obreon. But not for long. One more vital throw. Mm. Nice, 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 nice. Got him, got him, got him, got him. That confusion did more to hurt us than anything the other Pokemon did. Alright, let's see what's next. Wild Plume. Why do you have Wild Plume? That doesn't make sense. I mean, it's Dark Body, I guess. <laughs> That's kind of suspect, though. Oh, please miss. Oh, thank God. Flame though. Get him. Come on, you got this. Come on, Nux. I know you can do it, bro. Alright, not bad, not bad. Yes! Can't hit him. Can't hit him. Can't hit this. Ding, ding, ding. You got it. Good job, good job, good job. Not bad, not bad. Who else you got? What other dark types do you have? There's not a lot of dark types in the game. Gengar. I mean, they all he also has, I guess, he has dark tendencies. I don't know if I would call him a dark type, though. Go, Kid Fisto, go. Like, I switched to Kid Fisto because I thought that he'd stand it better. <gasps> okay. Ooh. I thought it was going to be a way worse move. I'm pretty sure that this Gengar has Destiny Bond, so I was really banking on Kid Fisto going first because of the Quick Claw. But he did not. But it's fine. This Gengar is dead. Nice. <sighs> Murkrow, huh? Yeah, sure. I mean, I was gonna switch back to Dom, but it really doesn't feel like there's a need to now. Also, I'm pretty sure that this Murkrow would completely wreck Dom's life. Well, not completely. It's the flying type that I'm afraid of. I mean, it's still just a Murkrow. And a Murkrow die is just as good as any. Alright, so who's your last Pokemon? Sahal. Okay. Earthquake time. Mmm. Down goes Houndoom. Come on. One hit. Damn right. Got him. Wow, 1,000 shit. I should have kept it dumb. Karen was defeated. Aren't you good? I like that in a trainer. Ooh. So you want to hook up after this? Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with their favorites. Aw. <laughs> I like your style. And I actually legitimately like Karen. Girl, we actually share a lot together. I also believe in fighting Pokemon that way. Let's save. Okay. So, Karen is somehow ended up being the easiest person to fight in this entire game. We got lucky though, because I... The, the 40, level 47 is not something to kind of just sh sh shake off, I guess. 
Okay, so. Hyper Potion. Done. So, as I said before, Kid Fisto kind of needs all his rock throws to actually fight Lance. So, let's do a pee pee up. No. Ether. There we go. I can't believe I'm using an Ether on a rock throw, but I need the move, so. Whatever. Hmm, now here's actually kind of a problem. Who the hell are we gonna have to fight Gyarados? We really don't have anyone that can take him down, to be honest. Everything he has kind of... Hmm, I don't want to use Rollout. Because I'm pretty sure I get locked into Rollout the entire time I'm using it. This is more danger than anything else. Sandstorm. Swift. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. First of all, let's get this item off. And we'll prepare for Lance. King's Rock. Alright, Don. It's gonna have to be Nightmare. My boy Nightmare, you're gonna have to be the one to take him down. So here's what I'm thinking. Hypnosis and then Flash with Nightmare. I'm putting you through my thought process before I actually do it, because I'm very scared. How's your moves looking, actually? Headbutt, Hypnosis. And actually, the Hypnosis is a little low. Alright, time to use the last ether I have. Nightmare and on Hypnosis. It's. I'm actually kind of astonished that I'm using it on that, but. Yeah, what can you do? I'm saving it just to lock in that decision. Okay, but now to the subject of the three Dragonairs he has. It's really gonna be up to Nightmare and Dom. But also Kid Fisto. I don't think they have a move that can actually hurt Kid Fisto um, effectively. I think one of them knows Blizzard, but if we take that one out super early on... Let me see, how is your special defense? It's not bad, to be honest. And of course we have the Sacrificial Elephant, Babar, in case of anything. You know what? We might be able to bait out. I just don't know. I need to look. Can anyone learn Icy Wind? Just to actually check. Can anyone actually learn it? No one. Damn. Everyone can learn Hidden Power, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, everyone can. Night Punch has like a super low chance of hitting. Do we have something that protects? We have Detect. Hmm. Let's see. Who's our fastest Pokemon here? I believe it is actually still Nux somehow. Yeah, it is nuts for on through. Mm. What we can do is get rid of the um, tackle for detect, and what we'll then start is. Can anyone learn sandstorm actually? Pat Bar can learn it. Babar's not gonna live one turn, but no, damn it, it's too risky. We can learn Swagger. Everyone. 
No, I think that's it. I think that's basically it. I think I'm done with my planning. Next episode... We either lose to Lance... Or... Die trying, I suppose? <laughs> I don't know. Till next time, everyone. Either way... This is where it ends. Goodbye.